Wow, just wow. We've been on the road too long. So we are headed to Valle Vidal, the Valley of Life. The Rio Castillo flows through there. There's a private campsite there. Right on the river, it looks amazing. Maybe I can score that campsite. If not, go up to Cimarron Campground. And the one, and the two. I got you. Well, we'll at least get to the, a couple points I definitely want to see, like the Rio Castillo area and Comanche Point, and let's see if I can make it up to uh, Cimarron Campground. We're driving west out of Red River. We're gonna go up and around and down into uh, where you're kind of following the Rio Castillo into Valle Vidal. There's probably a way to cut through from here, Red River, straight through. I just can't find it on a map. You know, I could experiment, but not with the trailer and the dogs. You guys are my anchors, and I don't mean you keep me stable. All right, Shersh, you're my anchor. You keep me stable and you drag me down. How about that? With everything, there's good and bad, right, Sherman? The camper, it's its not an anchor, it's more its more of a parachute. Another good analogy, another good metaphor, it can save your life, it can also drag you down. Resistance, wind resistance, really it's that tent on top. And I can feel the difference. I've driven this trailer on the highway 75, whatever. But with that tent on there, I can feel it, it's like, oh. Washboards, washboards. Got on this dirt road and it's been nothing but washboards and Four miles to Castillo Campground and Park, which I know they have great campgrounds right on the Castillo Creek. I will just get a campsite detached, then I can go kind of explore. Just get rid of this anchor, get rid of this parachute. Not you guys though, you guys will stay with me. Wow, this reminds me of the Palisade Sill heading from uh, Eagle's Nest to Cimarron. Very similar. Now here's the signs I'm seeing. Oh, what a nice little creek. Oh man, I could, I could, problem is what's ahead of me, we don't know. I could detach, take the forerunner in, pay, and then I'm detached for the rest of the day. Or I could keep going and see, I mean, does it get much better than this? Maybe I'll look on my phone a little bit, if I have any signal, which I don't. And I just, this, this is great. I mean, what do you, what, what do, you want from life? <laughs> Why are you being picky? Let's see what Sherman thinks. What do you think, Dersh? How about you? Look at the red crack. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Dodo, opinions? Park it. I'm tired of shaking around. I mean, come on, picky pants. Complete with dandelions, cow pile. This is what I was kind of envisioning, so I'm not sure why I'm hesitating. So, let's say we do it. And I just got internet, 3G. <laughs> My roll is pretty perfect, so I think we're done. Pretty damn level, so the dogs are gonna love the grass. Ladies and gentlemen, we are level. The guy's grass. Yeah, squat it. Grass. As far as the eye can see, kind of. Grass. Okay, let's come out here and pee. Okay, look out. Don't go pee pee there. Just let's have some living space, maybe. The whole earth isn't your toilet. Go for a swim. Oh, she's gonna take a shit right there. Damn. You had you had to poop right there. Okay, that's a little close there, buddy. Why can't you just shit in the pile you just shit in? Okay, it looks like you have a problem. Look, look out for the door. Yeah, that's a good idea. Go in there while I set up stuff. Oh, wow, she jumped all the way. Go, Sherman. Don't be scared. You got it. Go, Shermie. Wait, no, watch this guy. Watch this guy. Oh, hey, look at that. I can't believe she made it up. All right, back to bed. Good night, everybody. Guys, hang tight. Nope, stay, stay. Okay, so I'm in site R2. You come up here to pay, just not even a couple miles uh, south of my campsite on the river. And that's the deal, 30 bucks, you know, totally worth it. What is it, a ram? Hi, buddy.
Oh, he's he wants to ram. What you gonna do, buddy? <laughs> he's not afraid at all. Oh, there you go. Okay. You go out in the field and pose. So I'm gonna picture your butt. Oh, smile. There we go. All right, buddy. I'll, I'll get out of here so we can continue eating. I apologize. Thank you. That's a big dog, huh? Sure, sure. <laughs> what was wrong with his ears? Big, weird, curly ears? So this is Comanche Point. This is the confluence of the Comanche Creek and Castillo Creek. Wow. It's really neat. Isn't that amazing? There's Comanche Creek. There's Castillo Creek confluence. Tunnel. Road. Castillo continues. Ran to the car just in time. Just now started recording, but I just got dustified by that cattle truck. I'm here at Comanche Point, and there's nowhere to like, there's nowhere to park. Like, you think this would be a bigger, bigger deal, you know? To me, it is. They can make parking out of this. Here comes another truck. I'm gonna get dustified again. I would move, but I would have to turn around. Sorry, buddy. Now watch this dustification. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. Here comes another one. Oh my god. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Dusted. By the way, we did cross over into the National Forest. I didn't tell you that. So now those trucks that dusted me, I'm stuck behind them. So we're gonna do a Austin Powers turn around here. We're gonna go down here, hit Valley Vidal, up to the Castillo Reservoir. Well, that one's closed. This one's closed. It doesn't have a sign that says, please shut. Oh, it's a, there's a lock. Yeah. So you can't go to the Castillo Reservoir? I guess the reservoir is not in the National Forest, so whatever, that's fine. Who cares? Uh, yeah, that's a, this is locked too. Huh, wonder why you can't go to Castillo Reservoir. All right, I feel raindrops. So, hey, let's head back to the camp because you know why? We have a kick-ass camp. I can't wait to sit there. What do you guys think? Go back to kick-ass camp? Okay. Look at this one. <laughs> She's older. She's a year older, right? He turned 10 this year. She's about the same. She's a rescue, so we're not sure. She's 9 or 10. I think 10. And she's definitely 11 but we're doing good, let's head back. Scat. Look at this bend in the river, look how close it is to just taking that over. It's been rained on, this is beautiful right here. You're doing good, buddy. You could go in the back and lay down, like Cassie. Me putting this close to him will make him nervous and he'll make his noises anyway. I was gonna snap off. Oh. There, he spewed it. Did it make your noises or not? There's a spew. Any more spews? Oh, that's a big one. Okay. Thanks for your solo. I guess this is still considered La Sueva Canyon. Red chili water. Artificial fly or lure with single barbless hook. Catch and release only. So that tells you what red chili water means. And the green is a whole nother thing. Look it up. <laughs> Here's the structures. I love it. I'm a little scared though. That's scary. This is uh, Carson National Forest.
Any Blair Witches in here? Animals. Linoleum. This is unsafe. Here's a shitter. It's an attic. Some bird, bird's nest. So the look at that wiring. It's good stuff. This is a, where the cows live, I guess, where they come home, where the cows come home to roost. What? This is a beautiful valley. Can you imagine have, live, living here though? A house right here? I mean, this, is, this would be your view if this was your house. Oof. Anyway, someone farms this. Farm is in cattle farms. Oh man, here comes a little two wheel drive car. I'll let them pass. Yeah, you can do, it doesn't matter. You don't need a four wheel. You can hit all this and two wheel drive. Uh, uh. Sorry about that noise. <laughs> I'm bringing my Yugo next time, man. Yeah, look at that. Let's look at that S curve. Oh my God, it's more than an S. It's a snake. If you look in the distance, it curves again, of course. Almost there, Shirsh. Oh my God. I just need to go fast. All right, let's just go fast. Get through these washboards. Come on, Craig, where are you? This is R3. Hey, that means, guess what? Hey, Craig, Craig's still there. Where are you, where are you? Oh, 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 oh. Sherman bailed. Okay, we're pulling in our camp. No more shaky for the rest of the day. Aren't you guys happy? Coming this way? And the one, and the two. Come on, Dodie. I got you, I'm not gonna throw you. Jeez. Good day, huh? Here's your blankie, guys. Oh, who shit right there? You big dummies. All this grass and you're shitting right near camp. Oh man, you guys are. I'm gonna make you, I'm gonna put your blanket right on the pile of dung. Right there. Gross. Those are nasty. I just wanna go in the car. I'm like, we just got out of the car. You guys wanna go to bed? Go to bed. Go to bed. Go Sherman. Go Sherman. Don't walk in your own shit. She about walked in the other dog's shit. Such a holios. Why do you got a holio all day long? Stay off my face pillow, that's all I ask. You guys relax while I clean up your in camp poop. I can't believe these dogs. And this is like disgusting. It's gooey. About to lose the sun over this cliff here. So that's good. Cause right now we're, Awning's not shading much. That's shading the side of the camper. You know, but we're gonna get total shade. It's gonna get cool fast. It was kind of defaulting to camping in Cimarron Canyon, but it's that, that camping experience is just like this with the Cimarron River, right? Not just like this at all because it's a grid. It's a, I think it's a state campsite, not federal. I think it's New Mexico State camping, uh, which is fine, but you'd have, you know, neighbors and gravel and this is pretty unique as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> There's a little bit of cow pile parts here. Just little, it's old and dry. It looks like bark, but it's old cow pile. But this little uh, old dried parts of cow pile are way better than fresh, greasy dog turds right next to camp, which I'm gonna have to cover with something. I cleaned it up, but it's, you know, like gooey in, in the gosh darn grass. Sorry, but it's true. There's a big ass rock. I might get a big rock and put it on that poop pile. Oh man, just dust. Right through here, it's not too bad until someone drives by, I guess, but we're getting this wind that's whipping through here and my awning went up. I have a stake down at the foot, but I better guy it. It's the sun sets, so we may get some whippy winds. Good old whippy winds.
Wow, just wow. This is just beautiful. Did I mention how beautiful it is? Okay. Can't get enough. We've been on the road too long. <laughs> this was licking that one. That was getting his hump on. <laughs> this is actually... Sherman, get out of there, dude. It actually isn't that uncommon of a thing back home. But usually, the little one's getting attacked by the big one, which and they're both females. And then the one humping is, guess what, the male. Oh, look at that. But he never... He's never successful in his endeavor, let's just say that. I'm glad to see him kind of acting normal and relaxed or whatever. Whoa! Whoa, scrapping. Good times. Um, there goes the cattles. She got a wide stance. She's ready for a hurricane. That noise is fine. You're safe, okay? I know, that's intense. That sounds like thunder. But you're all right. No, you're all right. You're all right. In case it wasn't obvious, like, all this is our our uh, our space. I mean, it's amazing. This trail kind of goes past those trees to the next site. Like, wait, I didn't even realize this until I walked over here to try to get some pictures, but... Fisherman's Path. Maybe you can see the little marquee for the next campsite way over there. These guys are getting brave now. <laughs> Two out of three here are getting brave. The one over there wrapped, <laughs> wrapped up in the blanket. Not so much. See the cow piles? Can you see the cow piles? Awesome. See, look how brave they're getting now. Look at Sherman. Come on. Come on back, buddy. Hey. 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 What, what do you think you're doing? Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Brave guy. Got for the cow pile. See the cow piles? They're bigger than you. No, Sherman. No, 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 no. Keep on moving, Bubba. Stop it. God, stop it. Stink. Hey, Zola, stop. Lay down. Come on. Hey, guys, don't go far. Cassie, Sherman, get back here. Cassie. Good boy, Sherman. Cassie. Good girl. Don't do that. Don't do that. Get her again. Go. This is good entertainment. Get her. Right. Oh. <laughs> oh no, you don't. You better share. You better now watch this if Zola gets it. Oh denied. You better get in there, get it. Get her, Sirs. Dog. Dog. Go. Get it. Oh, coming in hot. Uh oh! Somebody else got it. Get the stick. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Back to the good old days when dogs just went after sticks and not expensive ass toys. Sure. You guys wanna go to bed? Yeah. You wanna go to bed? Sherman, you wanna go to bed? You go to bed? After all, it is like seven o'clock or eight o'clock. Yeah, go up here and then go up here. Oh, look at that. I'm an athlete. Good job, guys. Night or nights.
knocking on the wall of the camper to get out. And then she goes in there and pukes in the camper on the floor. Oh my God, the night of the puking dogs. <laughs>